you Hannah and today we are uh, yeah. Hey guys, it's me Hannah and today we're gonna be cooking. So today I thought you know why not cook something different. So today we're gonna be cooking steamed banana leaf pancake. So that's a very famous Kerala dish, you know. So um, it's kind of hard, and uh, my grandmother always makes this in snack time, and it's so and it makes you so strong and fit, and it's also really healthy. So the first thing you need is the dough, right? Like chapati dough. So the ingredients you need for that is a cup of hot water, some salt, like little salt. A cup of rice flour and one teaspoon of ghee and oil, and then you need to put all those ingredients in a bowl, and then you know just mix it like the chapati dough and the idiyapam dough, right? Uh, like you make it right. Just comment down below if you do. So um, that's done. The dough is done, and the next thing you need to do is the jackfruit mix. Now this is a re the really hard part. So the thing, the ingredients you need uh, for this jackfruit mix are some very ripe jackfruit pieces, and then you need to put, uh, put it inside the mixer and then you know just mix it really nicely. You know, just don't don't mix it like mix it, mix it, mix it, and don't turn it into goo. Blech. Don't turn it into goo, okay? So then you put in the mixer, just mix it, and then you need to put in that into a bowl, and then you need is some ghee. So you put the ghee into the uh, into the jackfruit mix, and then you need is the uh, the jaggery, okay? So this jaggery is actually liquid. Your parents will know this. Your parents will help you. So then you need to put the jaggery inside the uh, jackfruit mix, and then all these ingredients you should mix and mix and mix and mix and mix it till it becomes thick mass. Don't mix the dough, okay? Dough it's in another pot. So the next thing you need is the filling. So in the filling what you need is some ghee, grated coconut and the jackfruit mix we made. So then you mix all of that and then yeah, that's the end. And oh, you also need the banana leaf. So, so I'll see you all when I'm in my kitchen, okay? So hey guys, welcome back and this is the um, jackfruit mix that my grandmother made two to three days ago. It was in the fridge and then we took it out to make the snack. So let's get started with the snack. So the first thing you need is the dough we made. This is the dough. My mother made it a ball so it can be more easier. Then you need to put it in the banana leaf and then you just need to, you know, do it like this. You should make it, you know, thin, not thick. You should make it nice and big. Okay, that's done. And the next thing you need is the jackfruit mix plus the grated coconut. And then you should take this and put it in one side. Just don't take too much. So, it's done. And the next thing you need to do is you need to take this side of the banana leaf and then you need to just fold it. Don't fold it like, don't press it. Don't give it too much force. And then what you need to do is fold the corners. Oh, it's not staying. And the next thing you need to do is put it like this. And then you need to put it in the steamed pot. So then I'll just meet you guys when it's steamed, okay? Okay guys, I'm closing the steamer. Guys, the steaming is done. So, let's keep it outside. I'll just meet you guys. So guys, it's done. Let's open it. Ooh. So check whether it's hot or not. And then take a spoon and enjoy. Let's taste it. Thanks to my grandmother, my niece and my mother. 
who helped me make this. So that's it for today's video. So I hope you liked this video. If you did, please like this video, subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye! So guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please like. Wait, I should be doing this there. Should I?